Hello everyone and welcome back to Skyrim. When we last left off, what's that over there? We uh, just completed one of those books. What the hell is this? Ice Wraith? What are you? You're a Reaver Thug. Ah, interesting. Well, let's get stuck in. Resisted Soul Trap. What a git. Ooh, dear. Let's uh, cut this guy a new asshole or a new ass crack. You're not going to kill me quickly. I'm going to kill you quickly with fire and sword. Uh, still sword. Who's next? Oh, a nice ray. Didn't see you there, buddy. Oh, really? Since when did they become so useless? And you are a Reaver outlaw. Well, time to die, buddy. Wow, look at that. He barely lasted three hits. Take your gold, your roast leg. Imperial bow, really? God damn, no wonder these guys are no good. Bloody rubbish equipment that they're using. I really want to start exploring some more of this place. Ooh. Not necessarily... Um, I'm probably not going to do every dungeon off on camera. Emerald geode. Just because we probably would be here for 400 hours. Um... But it's up to you guys. Let me know how much or how little of this game you want to see. I'm kind of enjoying the way I'm doing it at the moment. But let me know. Wow, lots of geodes. Gold ore. I'll have some gold ore. Gold ore's always handy. We've got an arrow stuck in our armor. Uh, oh, what's that? Creep. Take the creep. Where is this bloody mine? Suppose. Ooh. What's that over here? Oh, look at that. Abandoned lodge. Now, we did actually discover this lodge, which makes it kind of interesting. Requires a key. Yes, I remember now. Not quite sure why. See what I mean, though, when I say um, things seem to have reset a little bit in the last few videos. Not quite sure what's going on. I did wonder if I um, didn't load the right save, but I did triple check ah! earlier. We definitely did. Uh oh. Uh -oh. oh, God. Ow. 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 Let's get some healing action going. Yeah, falling seems to be one of our worst enemies at the moment. I'm tempted to have a look in these mines. But I do want to start. Oh. A reaver. Aha. Okay. As long as it's not those annoying little things. They are annoying and little. Hey, Mrs. Reaver Outlaw. Time to die. Wow. You were barely worth bothering with. And it's all rubbish. Oh, yeah. We might as well start picking up pretty much everything. Because we can just summon that, um, that guy. But, on the flip side, we also have to be careful, because I don't know how often he respawns his money. Most merchants in this game, I think, is 24 hours. I saw the Fadrin brothers plodding around in there this morning, so that makes three. And now we're stuck out here listening to it all day and night. What are they listening to? stuck out here than floating in there. Oh. What's going on in here? I knew it. All right, you get. Guess the game's over. Come on, defend yourselves if you must. Lucky hit, he says as my sword pierces his cheeks. Uh, let's take all that. Take it all, apart from the stuff that is really proper pointless. And another reaver. Need to watch our weight. Not even going to bother with iron arrows anymore. Wow, look how freaking cool that looks. Oh, man. Hey, Lydia. Nice of you to join us. Start mining. Now, I always like to go to the mines. Because you obviously usually get a lot of ore. Well, yeah, I say a lot of ore. You get a little bit. I might try and find a mod that gives us more ore 
from each ore vein because it just seems a little bit pointless that we come across this massive vein of ore but there's only like one piece of actual ore there charcoal I don't think we need charcoal I know um, you can use charcoal for certain thing ah so this place flooded interesting so how much exploring can we do in here Ooh. No, we don't want to search the skeleton. We want to search the bloody great chest in front of us. Glass Warhammer of Immobilizing. Wow, chance to paralyze the target for four seconds. Yoink, we're breaking that sucker down. For sure. Uh-oh, drowning. Ugh. Really wish we had an air meter. I had one in um, uh, Oblivion. I think you did. Anyway, I'm trying to remember now. Minor healing, skirmishes potion, healing. Yeah, I think you had one in Oblivion, and you definitely had one in Morrowind, I think. I like that. Yeah, we definitely had one, I think. Right, let's get Mr. Dakota out. Go for a sly kill on that guy. Oh, nice. Actually... Kind of, maybe. Is someone there? I just saw my friend, like, die from an arrow. Not 100% sure, though. Yes! Yeah, you knew it. Nothing gets past you, does it, buddy? You're dead now. Ah, an orcish sword. Something you don't really see every day. Um, the dwarven arrow. Orcish. Ah, we might take the orcish sword. One thing I wouldn't mind to know, uh, I think I said this before, but I've forgotten, if we can get a ring of night vision. Now, in uh, Oblivion, you could. And again, in um, uh, Morrowind, you could. Let's take, we don't really want the raw food, so we'll leave that. And it was actually really good. It was um, so much better than having to rely on torches. Because torches in this game are pretty pants. I mean, they do light the place up quite nicely, but... I didn't really want that, but that's fine. But they um, had a real bad ad adverse effect of taking up one of your hands. And they do eventually run out, too. Ooh. There's a lot more in here than I thought there would be. Who's on the fire? Really? Someone's been chucked on the fire like another log. Fair enough. Ooh, garlic. Love the garlic. All right, Lydia. Oh. Come on. This way. Now, what do we have? Ooh, hello. Tankard. I don't want the tankard. I don't want the clam... Uh, sod the clam, actually. I don't think the clams give us anything, apart from clam meat, which we can't eat raw. So there's... Ooh, 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 ooh. That was almost bad. Don't know if that was a trap. Uh-oh. So I don't know if that was a trap, or whether that was just bad maintenance of this area in general. Right, let's get some healing action going. There we go. And we shall get our bow back out, actually. Why not? Ah, oh, hello. Nice. And let's get another one on him. Really? Damn. It's gone down. Ah, we've leveled. Cool. That's interesting. I thought that she might be a slave. I guess not. Right, let's get our sword out. Go back to sword. There we go. Oh, Lydia, stop killing everybody. I need the experience. Gold lockpick. Hey, buddy. What are you doing in this place anyway? Ooh, nice. Lydia, please don't hit me with your damn arrows. 
Ale. Ooh, gold. Ah. <clears throat> Interesting. Take the dwarven arrow. Uh, steel arrows we will take because we can sell those. Everything else is a little bit worthless. And by everything else, I mean um, iron. Kind of at the point now where iron is just utterly pointless. Ah, hello. Oh, gold. Take the gold ingots. What else is there? I cannot see because of the bloom. Ah, oh, it's just food. And barnacles. Right, what is that? Nothing. Ah. Oh. That's that book again, but we've already read that there. Ooh, hello. That was slyly hidden. Gold, healing, magicka. Really? I got excited there for a minute. I was like, ooh, what valuable goodies can be within? Ah, uh, nothing. Really? Um... Ah, here we are. So these places can be really disorientating. Right. Oh, yeah, something hurts us there. It has to be the rocks. Something going on with the physics. Skyrim. Now. Where do we need to go from here? Ah, oh, I guess that was it. Unless we can explore deeper underground, which is possible. <laughs> oh god. Anything hidden here? No. Alright, well, okay. I guess this place was shorter than I thought it was going to be. Right. We definitely... Yeah, we went that way. There's nothing seemingly under that water. And there's nothing more there. Oh, okay, fair enough. That was easier than I thought it was going to be. Short but sweet. Look at all these people that died. I wonder what they caved in. Ah, they shouldn't have been here. Digging around like dicks. Come on, Lydia. Let's go. Places to go. People to see. Actually, let's wait for 24 hours. And call in our merchant friend. And see if he's got all of his money back. Because if we can... Hmm... I don't know. If we can do this, is there really any point? Because the amount of time this takes, you might as well surely just go somewhere to sell stuff. I don't know. I'm not sure. We'll have a fiddle with it and see what happens. Shame there's no place around here to sleep. Right. So in theory... So soon. You must be hungry for a deal. Yeah, I guess so. I can hardly. Ah, wait. so he he has two thousand, and he seems to have some like random stuff every time he spawns, which is interesting. Okay, well, you can have that. I want that. You know what? Just take the iron arrows. They're not worth anything to us. Take the orcish sword, steel arrows. Sure, take them. Get them out of here. Don't need those or any of that. Damn, this is feels ridiculously easy. Ebony shield. You know, I guess this is probably actually easier than um, going somewhere. Scan increases light armor. We can get rid of that because this guy actually has a guaranteed nice amount of money. So, actually, I, th I might as well sell all the booze and all the stuff we can't use. Get our most out of him as we can. Pheasant. Raw clam meat. Yeah, you don't eat that. Horse meat. Raw leg of goat. Sack of flour. Damn. And I think that's pretty much it. Uh, I guess you can have all these books. What miss? What have we got here? Ah, all this rubbish. We will keep the gold, just because we can use that. Um. Okay, off with you then, buddy. I do so love dealing with. I'm sure you do. Now back to oblivion with ye. 
Oh, we leveled. I forgot about that. Let's get some more health. I want to try and get 300 health. Now, let's continue going with our enchanting. And shock enchantments, why not? Now, we're going to have to make a Mark II bow soon, I think. Extra effects. Oh, I'm going to have so much fun when we unlock this. I'm probably not going to make any more enchanted items until we fully level this up. And then we can go nuts with it. Um, now, let's actually, before I forget, let's do that one. Which I believe is the final book we have. The top one was the main quest. second one's the one we did last video. Don't worry, Lydia, this is possibly the first, the last time, I should say, that we're going to do this. He's, he's getting addicted. It's, it's too exciting. Ooh, hello. What? The cheese is this. Lock. Oh! Clear lock picking perks. Clear pop picking perks. Speech perks. Ah! Look at this. This. We could completely reset everything. Here. And really build our character how we want. Spend one dragon soul to remove your two-handed perks and gain one perk point. Um, let's say no, just because... Oh, okay, we did it anyway. I didn't want to. Right. We have 11 skill, um, dragon souls. So what should we do? Let's get some more enchanting. Requires a hundred, of course it does. So let's let's grab that. What else can we reset that we don't really use? Two-handed, one-handed. We want to keep. Hmm. Now we keep that as it is. Archery we'll keep as is. Ugh. Light armor we don't have any, do we? No. Sneak perks. I don't think. No, nope, we don't have any there. Lock picking perks. Let's clear those. Oh, we're we only gonna. We're only gonna gain one perk, really. Oh, even though I went to no, it's still. That's kind of interesting. Where's lock picking? Hmm. So we've only actually, yeah, adept locks. Right. Well, let's leave lock picking alone for the time being. And let's put stuff into alchemy. Because alchemy is what's going to make us incredibly wealthy. Although we already are pretty wealthy anyway. This is a badass book. I never knew what this one was. This is really cool. So let's get that. <clears throat> We're going to be such a badass when it comes to lockpicking. One-handed. So 80% more. Uh, less stamina. Yeah, so we don't want to reset that. Archery... 40% more damage, 10% chance of a critical hit, so we don't want to reset any of that. We actually don't have many um, skills spent. Fire spells do more damage. So we should really be using um, fire spells anyway, because we've put more into them. Interesting, interesting. Restoration, again, is something that we really want to try and Ah, put some points into. Once a day heals 250 points automatically if you fall below 10% health. That, again, is really strong. Gives you a bit of a... I, I always thought that was like having a fairy in a bottle in a Zelda game. Okay. So can we not get a bonus from this area? I guess not. 
We can actually use this here to level up our um, health. I wonder <clears throat> if we grab that. Can we sit in one of these pools and just heal? We actually can. This would be a real good way of leveling up our restoration magic. It's kind of interesting. So health is constantly going down and we're constantly healing. Apparently um, magic and stuff goes up, or restoration goes up, um, faster if you're in combat. But I don't know if that counts as combat. I'm not 100% sure. Right, let's get out of here anyway. <clears throat> so that is pretty much all completed now. So we've done all the books. At least we've done all the books that we can find. Uh oh. Who are you shooting at, Lydia? What is it? What is it? It, of course, is these gets. Right. Good night. Uh, give me your gold and your lockpick. Ooh, nice. Who else? Who are you shooting at? Ah, oh, hello. Hey, buddy. Good night. I will take your crappy armor and your gold. Right. So now, I suppose pretty much the only thing we really have left to do in this place is go see the uh, bloke that lives in the mushroom. Can't remember his name. And try and get some quests off him. And then we're probably. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Ah. Oh. Okay. That is a prime example of where the Ring of Cheetah Speed does us no favors. Wow, look at that guy. Okay, let's kill you again. I guess we could use sparks. You're pretty weak. So you should level my uh, magic up a little bit. And we'll take those again. So they are only copper, so there's no real um, point. But if anything, if nothing else, we can enchant them before we sell them. Which is something I've been doing. Don't know what happened there. We kind of went into the kill cam and then it stopped. For some reason. Ah, it doesn't matter. It's Skyrim. Right, let's... Grab some healing. And go see the man in the mushroom. Preferably without killing ourselves. Now, I don't want to fast travel. Just in case... We can unlock some more um, dungeons. Now, I'm tempted to do, like I said earlier, I'm tempted to do some of these dungeons off camera because I do want to do them all. But <coughs> I don't know if people want me to do them off camera. So the jury's out on that one. Let me know. Let's go see matey boy. And that armor is still so cool. I guess what we could do, we could grab this quest off this bloke and then go back to the skull, or skull, however you say it, and um, see if we can get some of that funky armor. Ooh. Okay, guess no one's home here, but this is the kitchen, so that's fine. Now, who are we? Aha. Hmm. Got something Who's in for here? Just about everybody in here. Give have you now? If you have any question, I don't care if he's a master wizard. He can't treat me like this. Yeah, he does treat people like shit. Master Nola? What that did he do? Told me to fix his house. Okay. If I don't, he'll find a new mycologist who will. Right. Decades of loyal service, and he'd just throw me out like yesterday's breakfast. Hmm. What do you need to fix the tower? Three tap roots soaked in the headwaters of the Harstrad River. I'm an old woman. I can't possibly make that trip. It's way too dangerous. If okay. you get some tap roots, I'll pay you to dip them in the headwaters and bring them to me. Do you have any tap roots? What can you tell me about the Harstrad headwaters? It's special to the Spriggans. They seem to like to gather there. Oh, goody. Something about the waters attracts them. There are bound Damn to be some there, so be careful. Spriggans, 
Have you seen Verona? She left for Raven Rock hours ago. She promised to bring me back some fresh blister wart. Okay, where can I get taproot? Where do you think? You have to cut it out of a spriggan. Wow. Although sometimes you can buy them from alchemists. Well, Every type okay. of fungus in Solstheim or Skyrim. Oh, and a few other ingredients and potions. Alright, what have you got? Uh, do you have taproot perchance? Yes, you do actually have a taproot, but you weren't going to tell us that, were you? Or you could have given it us for free. Right. Let's just buy all of this stuff. Because I'm going to want to make a lot of potions. Oh, God. Don't want to do that. Right. Um, now, we can sell her some rubbish. To get our money back. At least a lot of our money, anyway. Get rid of that. Um, anything that we have that's truly useless. Not really. Yeah, that's kind of crappy. Uh, we sell the boar meat. I always like to try and do a straight trade if I can. Although she doesn't seem to be... Oh, I can sell that back to her. She's made one and a half thou off us. She's actually come Blah. out of that quite well. Another wanderer. I suppose you'll be wanting potions just like the others. I make my own thanks. Um, yes. When did you come? That was a lifetime ago. I was just a young girl when Red Mountain erupted. Master Neloth was already old. Huh. My mother put me on a boat to Skyrim. The last time I ever saw her... She was standing on the dock as my ship sailed away. Damn. Okay. What'd you do for Master Noloth? I am his mycologist. He may have grown Tel Mithrin by himself, but I nurture it. Mushrooms yeah. and fungi are my life's work. When I saw Tel Mithrin, I knew I had to be here. I've learned so much since then. Did you grow this tower? Me? No. That's Master Neloth's doing. I wasn't even born then. It's Telvani magic at its best. He brought the cuttings with him from Morrowind and used sorcery to grow them. Interesting. Okay. Well, let's go do her quest quickly. I would have thought it's a relatively easy one to do. We are quickly approaching the time limit. Um, so that's where we need... No. Where do we need to go? Ah, right, so we need that. Unfortunately, it's not going to show us where we need to go until we get the tap roots, which is a pain in the bum. So, oh, that's the place we need to investigate. That's interesting. Let's go back to Raven Rock, see if we can buy three tap roots. Look at that armor, that looks awesome. We have to try and invest in a the set of that. Entire island isn't covered in ants, you know. They have huge ice fields up north, and it's freezing up there. Ah, freezing. We're used to the freezing. See, most of this still isn't growing back. Never mind. Right now, where is our alchemist woman? There she is. No. I don't know who sent you here, but you've given us something to build on here. Hope someday we can repay you for your kindness. So yes, you're that's very nice. In my potions and ingredients. I'm interested in your ingredients. Yep, I'm interested in tap one tap root. <sighs> Bugger. Remember, I have plenty of potions and ingredients. If you're ever in the Any market. help will do. Who's saying they're starving? Oh, I'll give you this warning only once. Stay out of my way, and we'll are you do starving? just fine. The mines are open, and the shop is busy. Your again. actions here have Thank been you. a blessing Who's to us. Who's starving, Sir Joe? Joe. Oh, I guess nobody was. Must have just imagined it. Right, let's Love sell our junk. The name. <clears throat> Take a look. Hope. Oh no! Damn it! We just need one more tap root. That's kind of annoying, actually, because I don't. Oh no! Where we can go to get one? Bring your. I don't know where. 
the Spriggans were. Maybe there? Perhaps? Nah, it can't be. Can't be. Where would there be Spriggans? I guess one thing I could try and do it's a bit on the old cheating side. Now, she's there. Let's wait 24 hours. In fact, let's wait 48 hours and see if her stock refreshes. I'm pretty sure most stock refreshes in 24 hours. Most. Um, hers may be longer, so that's why I say give it 24 hours if need be. Just need one more taproot. How hard can it be? I wish you would say on the map where you need to go yeah, once you get the item. I, I don't know who sent you here, but you've given right, me something let's... to hold on for. Actually, I we can, can teach you a thing train an alchemy again. Why not? It's not cheap, but it's good. Take a look. What have we got for sale? Now, do you have taproot? She still doesn't have taproot. Let's try another 24 hours. Failing that, I'll end the video. Uh, I'll find some taproot off camera and then when we come back we'll go to that place but it usually doesn't take them that long to refresh their stock usually really doesn't take long to refresh their stock so that's all the more frustrating usually Spriggans are in big clear areas but there isn't any big open clear areas here that I can really see I mean, there's a grove there, which we may look at. I can't thank you enough for reopening the ebony mines. You That's all right, sir. That's all right. Let's wait for this woman. Where's she gone? You ah, there she is. Where I, I don't know who I sent you here, but you've given us something to build on. Yes, 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 yes. No Just so have you got a taproot yet? Potions and ingredients. I am. I want taproot. Damn. No. Okay, let's just fast travel to the grove. Now, hmm. A grove sounds like somewhere where, ah, Spriggans might rest at. Now, if I remember correctly, there were a lot of Spriggans around, somewhere around here. Let's just grab all this stuff. Oh, an ash do whopper. It's interesting. Right, guys, I'm gonna kill this guy. Now I'm gonna save the video. Save the video. Save the game, I should say. And when we come back, I would have found another tap root. And we'll continue from there. So I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Thanks for watching. And until next time. What is hitting me? Oh, there's another one. Alright, well, we'll just kill this guy. Come on, you. Your soul is mine, and I do need your soul, too. Ah, it looks like someone else is actually attacking us, too. Is there another one? No. Alright, guys. I'm going to leave it here. Thanks for watching. Until next time.